Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are likely to spend quality family time with members of the royal family as improving relations do not seem to be very high on anyone's agenda. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are unlikely to spend much time with the royal family, aside from the occasional meeting following their public fallout in the aftermath of Maxit. According to a royal expert, reconciliation did not seem to be a priority for the couple and there is little chance for the queen to meet her newest great-granddaughter, Lilibet Diana, anytime soon. Royal commentator Jonathan Sassadotti said, I would say that it's perhaps unlikely that they're going to be spending what we would think of as quality family time together at Christmas and New Year's or birthdays. I mean, just remember, the queen hasn't met her latest granddaughter. It doesn't seem likely that she's going to anytime soon. She's barely seen Archie for quite a while. So again, on a human family level, forget them being the royal family, there's already quite some frostiness and distance there. Mr. Sassidoti added, I suspect if things can go well, maybe they will have the occasional meeting, but I don't think it seems very high on anyone's agenda. The royal family have not seen Meghan Markle since her final engagement as a working royal on March 9, 2020 at a Commonwealth service in Westminster Abbey. The Queen and Prince Charles are also not believed to have seen the couple's sons Archie Harrison since November 2019 when they moved to Vancouver to spend the Christmas holidays. Relations between the Duke and Duchess of Sussex and royal family have been strained since the Mexit announcement last year. The couple decision to step away from their roles as working royal was said to have blindsided other senior members of the royal family. Since renouncing their HRH titles and relocating to California, the Sussexes have conducted a number of high-profile interviews where they have criticized the British monarchy. During their tell interview with Oprah Winfrey in March, the couple revealed that Meghan had been left feeling suicidal after her husband family ignored her request for mental health support. Other damning allegations included Buckingham Palace refusing to correct damaging tabloid articles, the royal family refusing to offer their son a title, and a member of the family making a racist remark about the skin tone of their unborn son. The interview caused a PR crisis for Buckingham Palace and worsened the already strained relationship between Prince William and Prince Harry. Although the two brothers display a united front during the funeral of their grandfather Prince Philip in April, reconciliatory talks behind closed doors were reportedly unproductive. The Duke of Sussex most recently returned for the July 1st unveiling ceremony of a statue dedicated towards Princess Diana. Both dukes appear relaxed in each other's company, however, Prince Harry left Kensington Palace shortly after the ceremony concluded. There are no current plans for Prince Harry, Meghan, or their two children, Archie and Lilibet, to return to the UK anytime soon.